What is up YouTube? Welcome back to the channel. I have a 41212 narrow custom tactic that I'm using I'm using in Division 4 right now. Uh, it's not the Elite Division yet, but the games only came out four four days ago. Um, so all of the tryhards are basically in Division 4. Uh, Division 3, I think some people are getting to. I'm not sure yet. This is day four of the game, I believe for me. Uh, the day I'm recording this. So yeah, let's get into the custom tactics and I do have some gameplay at the very end. Um, on me using this in the division four so yeah just stay tuned for that so i'll go over everything very very quickly so you can watch the game plan how i actually build up and defend with this so this is a 4-1-2-1-2 narrow it's very good to counter like a 4-2-3-1 because the 4-2-3-1 is very very overpowered in this game this this year so 4-1-2-1-2 narrow is very very good uh and it's also good to play up against the 4-3-2-1 and it's very good to play up against any five at the back formation so 5-3-2 um, I've seen a lot of where is it five two one two, and I've seen a lot of three five twos. It's very and this one too three four two one. So it's very good to counter any of those formations. It is weak against the four four two second variation, four four two flat, and the four triple two. Where is it? It's very weak against these against these formations and formations that are wide. But any formations that are narrow or three at the back. Uh, this formation is very overpowered against, right? So the 4-1-2-1-2 two, two, two narrow uh, tactics are as follows. This is going to be for both old gen and new gen. I tried and tested it out on both. You don't have to change anything on both. The only thing you have to change is uh, chance creation, and that's up to you. So balance, 37 width, depth, 63. Build the play balance, chance creation, forward runs. Now, if you don't like forward runs, I play old gen. I prefer forward runs. I recommend trying forward runs on new gen too, but if you don't like it, then you can switch it to direct passing. Um, but that's the only thing that you should change. And if, if, and this is only up to you, if you're not comfortable with defending with 63 depth, if you are on new gen, then you can drop this down to 60, even like 55, no lower than that. I know they have that thing going on with the uh, under 45, like your team doesn't press or anything like that, but with this formation, you need to press. That's what I'm saying. So if you're on new gen, you could go as low as 55. That is it. 60 is a good spot. 63 is what I recommend. So you can manually press. If you're on old gen, I recommend staying at 63. If not, you can drop all the way down to about 50. No lower than that. Just stay neutral, stay compact, and you can go up to like about 57. But I recommend doing 63 on both consoles. Uh, with 47, so it's not too wide. A little bit more narrow than neutral. I experimented with going like 63 width. Didn't work. It's too wide. My players will start making overlapping runs. My right mid, my right center mid, and my left center mid. So there's no point in you doing that. Players in the box five. Corners and free kicks one and one. This you can change to whatever you want. I don't really care about that. I'm just not good at that. Uh, instructions. Goalie comes for cross the sweeper keeper. Both center backs stay back while attacking. That is it. Right back stay back overlap. Left back, stay back, overlap. Now keep in mind, when you are in game, you can turn on the D-pad tactics, the up arrow and then the left arrow for attacking fullbacks. If you don't like attacking fullbacks or if you know how to manually uh, trigger them with O1 triggers, like you'll see in the video that I'll post in a little bit or in the next few minutes when gameplay comes up, you can do a lot of L1 triggers to push them up, or you can do quick one twos with them to push your left back and right back up. If you're not comfortable with that, if you don't know how to do that, if you don't know how to turn on attacking fullbacks while you're in game, then just put on balance attack on one of them, two of them if you want to be rebellious. But I recommend starting off with stay back while attacking just to start off so you can learn how to use this, right? Because once you master it, you don't need to make them attack. Um, you just kind of do it on your own. CDM cut passing lane stay back while attacking cover center uh, right center mid is going to be uh, stay back while attacking stay on the edge of the box cover wing so he's your more defensive minded uh, center mid he, he's basically not he's not going to go inside the box basically he is going to go up a little bit but he won't go all the way into the box to make an extra striker if that makes sense uh, he's going to be like your recycle player the one that stays outside of the 18 just in case you need to recycle the play drop it back to cdm start the whole play over or stop a counter attack uh, that's the person that's going to be right there and then your more attacking minded center mid is going to be get forward get into box or cross cover wing i do play a winger there personally i'm not gonna lie i play gabriel martinelli there he gets a job done because he does those uh last minute half space runs and he gets right in between your opponent's um, right center back and right back. And your opponent can't do anything with it because he's already occupied by the camp and the other striker. So that's why I put a winger there because I need him to join in on the attack. I need him to be agile. 
and I also like him for finesse shot goals. So you'll see that in the in the clip in a little bit. Uh, Cam is going to be stay forward. That is it. Don't put get into a box or cross. It makes it too attacking, and then you're vulnerable for counterattacks. Just do stay forward for now. And then both strikers do stay central. Nothing else. Don't put don't put getting behind. Don't do anything like that. Let the custom tactics of forward runs or direct passing do the work for you. Because once you put them on getting behind, if you're not a through ball merchant like I'm not, you're just gonna have a hard time passing it to one of your strikers. And if you're playing against like a Baron uh, Van Dyke, like you do in the higher divisions. It's just hard to pass on 1v1, especially when you're playing like with Trissard, which I love playing with Trissard, but I'm just saying he's not going to outpace him, you know? Um, and I'll make this really, really quickly. The players that you need, meta, meta center backs, try to get one tankish center back and one more agile center back. So I have a tank center back with Saliba or Saliba and then Timber as my jockey center back just because he's more agile. Um, he gets the job done. Trust me, he's really good. Right back, left back, just make sure they can pass the ball, attack, defend, all that good stuff. So I got Yorente and Mekabi, whatever her name is. She's actually really good. Um, very, very good. I recommend checking her out. Um, they they can pass the ball, dribble, all that good stuff. Uh, CDM, make sure that they are a CDM, that they can defend a medium high. Preferably, if not a medium, medium, if not a high, high. But somebody that's more defensive minded. Uh, somebody that has very good defensive stats there. Then on the right center mid is going to be a box to box center mid, so a high, high work rate player, somebody that can defend, attack, like a Jude Bellingham. And then on the left one, you could put a winger there, that's what I do. Or if you want to put another box to box, kind of like a Modric, a Muziala, somebody like that, you could put them there too, but I put wingers there. Uh, Cam, 5 star weak foot or 5 star skiller, I prefer 5 star skiller. And then two strikers, just make sure that they're agile, fast, pacey, and they can score. You know who to play there. All right, let's get into some actual gameplay. I am using this Arsenal Pass and Present plus a little random uh, Ederson and a random Llorente just because Ramsdale is trash in this game and there is no good right back for Arsenal. So, yeah, check out the gameplay in 3, 2, 1. Alright, guys, we're going to be playing a 4 1 2 2 narrow against this team with Makano and Kunde in the back, the John Musiala middle, Fati from Torres, Warner, Rafinha. So, he's probably pretty good at left stick dribbling, if I'm not mistaken. And they're very energetic. Uh, this should be good in front of their which is fine. Today. You're just gonna have to and jockey, and that's why I'm playing Timber well, it's great at defense, because he ha or at center back, because he has work, good agility and balance. They need to link up with each other um, and I'm giving it a second, skills. making sure that my formation changes. Nice little chip ball. Send him with the L1 trigger. I don't like when the stadium has a little bit of sun like this. I like. The nighttime more, but it is what it is. All right, quick. Oh, who's that, Musial? That was good. Really clever pressing. Ah, bad pass. That was a really bad pass. Got it. Thank you, Martinelli. And it's Gabriel Jesus. And be patient. Beth Mead. No. Belty. Let's see. All right. Williamson. I'm trying to be Jason patient. McCabe. But and providing this guy's wind. parking the bus. There. Nice looking move, this. Ha. No PK. Cool. Do literally slam, slam my girl right there. Look no further than Frankie de Jong. That's cool. Stewart, what do you think we might see from him in this game? Well, the best players can play inside here, and he can certainly play inside here. All right, so your right center mid is more of your defensive minus center mid. So use that right center mid and use your central center mid as your defensive players whenever you're running back. Okay. I got it. Alright, let's see. I'm just gonna. Oh, I was trying to abuse Martinelli's speed, but I guess not. Let me not do that again then. I forget that Jones pretty good. Alright, let's see if I can get a quick play. Gabriel Jesus. Over the top through the ball. Dang it. 
Damn, no Sometimes visual. they make passing okay. look easy. I think I spoke too soon. Wasn't the best of This guy's really struggle. parking the bus. Which is fine. We'll get him on a counter. Ansu Fati. Got it. Just cutting off the supply. Thank you, Martinelli. Quick one twos. Jesus. Trossard. All right. Let's see. Thank you, Jesus. And it's Gabriel Jesus. <laughs> Must take Oof. the lead here. Double reverse elastico. You've got to say it has been coming. All right. So I just had to be patient, try to cut inside. Try to wait for those uh, passes with the forward runs. I had getting behind with my strikers, but uh, when I did that, I wouldn't have any support. Like, my cam would have to dribble through everybody, and sometimes you can't when you're playing against these, like, pretty good players. Okay, let's go. Let's see. No. Martinelli. There. Really fine piece ah. of defending play to break us up. Probably shouldn't have gone for the reverse elastico right there. Good effective pressure high up the pitch. Alright, switch off from my center back because I'm not trying to split open my Pretty defense. Fun. I could just run back with my CDM. Big. That's fine. Now I'll Now I'll split my center back. Nicely timed tackle. Trossard. Ooh, he was off, I think. Oh, it was a close run thing, but the goalkeeper just got there. That would have been a good play, though. All right, he's going to try to use the lines now. Ferran Torres. Torres. Really good build-up. Thank you, Arente. No All right. Hey. My dude Salabo got in my way. He literally attacked my own player. Oh, I should I should have watched the replay. Salaba literally tackled my own player. What kind of BS? And this is where people say that the game's rigged. And oh, and I sometimes agree with that because how does that even happen? And the attacking options appear plentiful. Trossard. Working away patiently, looking for an opening. There. Gabriel Jesus. There's the cutback. And uh, his opponent in the nick of time. This guy's really so parking the bus. And then offside's trapping. Well, at least you guys get to see like a high level game. I Still swear that ball went out. Really good challenge. All right. That was supposed to be for Gabriel Jesus. De Jong. All right. That's cool. With it. Just cut off the cut off the lane. Musiala. Just cut off the lane. Jeremy I think he's playing direct passing or forward runs. One or the other. Got it. All right, second half. Let's go into second half. All right, let's get into second half. I think he's still playing. He's playing me either like a four-four-two or a four-triple-two or something like that with two strikers. He's abusing the wings. So because he's doing that, we just got to counter him straight through the middle. Um, not let them have those wings or just if you do let them have the wings just cut off the like the basically the 19 the what is it the goal box Torres. Yeah, be careful with the kickoff glitch still a thing Leah Williamson nice Good little tiki taka now play. Marcinelli. 
On to Mead. Trossard. Oh. Possession lost. Really oh. closing him down. Thought I had that. Certainly have got to give this man high marks for All his right, work. So just run back with your center mids. Well, they weren't at their best, but with that see, equalize, you can they see usually mess so up. To this team. Hopefully they can get more of the ball to him in the second half so he can show us his ability. Can he put them in front? Oof. Yes, is the Trevella shot. And you have to say it was on the cost. That's why I play Trussar. Trussar's like 800 coins. So with the Hunter, two, he's like one. probably like 2k. I don't care, I'll continue using him. He has that agility, yeah, balance, four star weak foot, Travella. Like, what more do you want as a, from a striker, you know? Ah, except for that part. Oh, snap. I thought I had that. Alright, I gotta play the ball fast. Now with Jesus. Williamson. I do quick to Taka. Well, go. Ah, I ran out of space. I ran out of space. Is he going to quit? I'm not making any subs, so let's just wait and see what he does. All right. I think he's back. I think he just made some subs. I don't know who he put in. Uh, I, I'm assuming that's Alex Morgan and Kudus to SVC. Jeremy Frimpong. Fatty. All right, he probably made it more attacking too. Oh sh. I got it. I got it. Now attacking possibilities for Internacional. Trying to force him to go and back. For that good piece of defending. There you go. Superb looking pass. Could be in. And a goal! A significant deflection. And no wonder the Shit, goalkeeper is looking up at the sky. He's, he's rushing now. Underway again with the score. Alright, be careful with the kickoff glitch. All right, do quick one twos. No, Timber. not even gonna risk it. Now in possession, Trossard. That would go Martinelli. Nice. Takes the shot. Ball is loose, and it's two for him. I had to do the rebound. Sorry, guys. I had to do it. He gave it to me. Like, what am I supposed to do? Say no to that. Wonderful bit of skill. Thank you, Timber. In the end and danger averted for now. Oh, that was a bad pass. That was my first bad pass. Frankie de Jong. I didn't mean to do that. Okay, Thank you, Williamson. That would go. Martinelli. Oh, he's through here. E two behind. Now in a more than decent position. That was two behind. All right, and keep in mind, guys, this is Division Four, so this is not the elite. Okay, this is not the elite and division, but well, it's I'm pressed, getting there. You know, the job. game's been out a week, four four days, five days officially. So a lot of the tryhards are right here. A lot of them. So, I think I don't know who I don't know. I personally don't know anybody in the elite division already. And if you do, please let me know, because everybody that I know is either in division five, division four, stuff like that. Ten minutes to go, then. I don't even know if they're in division three yet. Jesus. Well, they're keeping their opponents moving and guessing. Surely. Ah, he moved his goalie. I should have shot earlier. Let me see. Nah. 
One thing I'm not good at this game is corners. So if you guys know like a corner kick tactic, let me know down below because everything else I'm decent at, just not corners. Thank you, McCabe. See, the only goal he scored was from a mistake that the game did, not even me. Oh, there you go. Spot on with that tackle. See, I like that that little skill move, but then I don't because it's very, very so slow. The final whistle, very the slow. Very much in command, Stuart. Well, what an excellent performance All this right. has been. They've had complete control for most of the game. Their movement, Thank clever you, passes, and energy have been a joy to watch. It's been a really good win for them. All right. Well, and then just remember, right I know I, I, right now I'm not even focusing That's anymore. I already chance. shut off the game. Uh, remember to let go of the sprint button in this formation since oh it's not like whenever you're building up make sure to let go of the sprint button because you have so many options everywhere with the four runs that you there's no need for you to turn on the sprint button like just let the sprint button go oh I probably could have lowered this right hmm. that probably would have been better oh well all right guys so that's that's where I'm at 4-1 Division four. There you go. I probably need what is it? One, two, three, four more wins. I'll be in division three. Probably get those maybe tonight, tomorrow, whenever I get the chance to play. I'll catch you guys on the next one. Peace.